Hi guys, Andy May here. Welcome back to the channel. So we are continuing with the end of the year declutter and we are going to cover the highlighters and face palettes that I have in my collection. So not a whole lot to look at, but I am getting rid of a few things, which is always a good thing. Okay, and here we have highlighter, which seems like a lot. Uh, but to be honest, I know two that I am going to be getting rid of. Um, one is actually brand new to my collection, which is this BH Cosmetics Illuminate by Ashley Tisdale. This was, I mean, when you look at it in the pan, it just looks so gorgeous. I'm going to absolutely love this. And then it's so, well, they're still like blush stain, like anticlimactic when I put it on my skin. It's just like... I don't know. I was just really disappointed with it and I don't need to work with it when I have a bunch of others. So that one is leaving for the declutter. Uh, the second one that I know that I'm going to get rid of is this NYX Duochromatic. Uh, this one is in Twilight Tent. Yes. So it shifts blue. It's really pretty. I actually really like it. I just don't ever wear it. Like I don't think I've pulled for this at all this entire year. Um, and I even got rid of my Kat Von D one. So, I mean, obviously I'm not doing as much of those duochromatic highlighters anymore. Now I will show you, this is the, um, white highlighter that's in the Anastasia Nicole Guerrero. And then it shifts a little blue as well. And then here's the NYX one. So I feel like I have something if I ever want that blue shift, so I don't need to keep that one here as well. And now the others I will be keeping. I did do a lot of kind of <laughs> swatch comparisons to make sure that they were like different shades or ones that I'm actually going to use. So these two will be leaving. And for 2019, I am bringing in a total of 10 individual pans of highlighter, but uh, two are like mini. Well, these three are all actually minis, and then these two are like mini liquid highlighters, but I do really like them both. So 10 highlighters for 2019. Don't think I'll be running out at all considering how long a highlighter takes to finish. I don't think I've ever even finished one. Okay, so here we have the face palettes. Uh, there is one that I'll be getting rid of. So for my face palettes, um, I didn't keep it this way before. Um, I don't believe I did. No, I did. I did keep it this way before. So some have changed since the last six months. Um, this has been depotted because the packaging was getting on my nerves trying to get into these powders. Um, so this is the Physician's Formula Bronze Sculpt in Matte, I think. Um, so it has three face powders here. And this is technically a highlighter palette, but for me, if it has two or more face products, then it goes into this category. So it's now considered a face palette. Uh, the one that I am going to be getting rid of though is this Hollywood Bronze and Glow. I really wanted to make sure that I liked everything that was in the palette, not just one item out of three. Like if I only liked one of these, um, I would need to get rid of that. There's no point in keeping all of that. Um, but for this one, I don't like the bronzer. I don't care for it at all. And then the highlight is a lot more subtle um, than what I care for now. Um, I do like more of my individual pans of highlight than this one. So this one is going and we are going to go into 2019 with a total of five face palettes. So I don't think that's too, too bad.